and I'm Code of Cyanide, and I'm talking about alter egos. So you know, like some of us have our own alter ego. We have another persona that we go by. Hell, we could have like ten personas that we go by. For instance, I go by somebody else besides Code of Cyanide. Yeah, I used to call myself Evangelist. It was my code name in the future where I'm actually from. Slight differences, I don't wear this wig with black hair in the red. This is actually somebody else's wig, by the way, if you didn't know, Skyblaze. <laughs> nice. Right, and um, these are not my sunglasses either. It's kind of funny. However, this is my shirt, <laughs> and these are my glove, or so you may think. But um, yeah, I changed my look on here. It became Code of Sinai, the evolution, the future. But you can be whatever you want, people. That's the thing is, in this world, you can do and be whatever you want. And I'm not talking about being a violent person and beating the hell out of someone for no reason. Now, I understand you're going to get mad because someone's taunting you and there's bullies out there. Now, those type of people deserve to get their ass kicked. And they're always the, they're the big guy trying to intimidate you. The thing is, it doesn't work anymore. In my honest, in my honest opinion, which I probably messed up on that line, which probably messed up a hundred more times. But yeah, in my opinion here, and this is not a fact, but it's close enough, right? Well, when someone tries to bully you and tries to intimidate you, the more they do it, the more they do it, it becomes so relevant in your life that you're just like, oh, this happens every day, and you're just like so happy to hear someone threaten you all the time. Like, I want your lunch money, I want your money. You know what, someone, someone always tried to do that. I never gave them money. I don't give a damn how big you are, how strong you are. You can beat the shit out of me. I ain't giving you no fucking money. And the second thing is, if you think you're going to intimidate someone into doing something for, for you, doing your job, making them scared that they're going to get beat up, or you're going to get a whole bunch of people to help you, that doesn't make you tough. Bullies nowadays, they're weaker than an actual person that they are picking on, so to speak. Yeah, some people, they say they can't defend themselves. That's not so true anymore. There's a lot of people out there that are not bullies, that are not real big-time fighters, but you wouldn't even know that. Like me, for instance, I just look like a normal person, but if you fuck with me, I'll beat the living hell out of you, and I don't even really give a damn no more. Let's talk about the tea party. Tea party, man. These people were fucking lunatic, crazy people making up rumors after rumors. You know what? I hate rumors. Suck on those balls, bitch. Anyway, second of all, acceptance. People were always trying to drive in this. I want to be accepted. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep on doing this, talking about the same subject over and over. You cannot make people accept you. People are not that open-minded. I mean, they can be, but they might not be. When someone says they're open-minded... And, and then they're not cool with with gays and lesbians or, and they're not cool with transgender people they're not cool with someone portraying a straight person when they're actually a gay person or a lesbian whatever it is on TV you're not fucking open minded people that is not the essence of being open minded you cannot be cool with something you know I grew up with a family, well, they're slightly open-minded, but it doesn't make any difference. You either are or you're not. Yeah, over years, you're fo sooner or later, things that are different will not bother you anymore. Like, people have a hatred towards cosplayers, for instance. I don't know if that's jealousy or not. And then this is another thing. A guy that dresses up like a girl. For instance, people on the internet people with no fucking balls no fucking guts come on there and they trash you and they say horrible things about you saying you're ugly you need to stop doing videos you need to do this you're you're you know the thing is about that is calling someone ugly on the internet and you don't have a video to show who you are or a picture of picture of yourself then that then your comment is irrelevant understand that so you can say whatever you want about me you can trash me, you can trash my friends, you can trash my family, you can do whatever the fuck you want. It won't do nothing. Just understand that. I might get mad. 
I might laugh about it. I might make a joke out of it. I might even make a video pretending to be you. But I'm not going to give a damn. Fuck you.